Yeah, since the scrimmage, we've picked it up a bit, I'd say, and uh, with Jimbo helping in, uh, some of the defensive players, myself, we're just picking it up, trying to bring some physicality to practice. That's it. Is it just one of those things, kind of you get in the middle of spring and kind of lose focus a little bit and have to get snapped back in? Oh, uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much what it is. We just, everybody knows we've come to an end now, so it might be a little lack of days ago, but we just, we about to pick it back up. That's it. I know Jippo said that you've caught his eye a couple times out there. What do you think is different for you this year? Um, this year, I say I'm more focused on the defense. Uh, I know exactly what I'm doing, so I'm playing faster. As of last year, where I moved to the outside, where I was playing outside, it was new new to me. So I was still kind of slow. But being back home in the middle, I'm just flying around, and I know what I'm doing. So it makes the game that much easier. Now, playing behind so many experienced seniors, what were we able to take away from those guys last year? Uh, Telvin, like every senior, I actually took a, like pieces out of their game and try to add it to my game and make myself better as a player. With Telvin, his leadership on the field and off the field, I mean, he's hype all the time, no matter what he's doing, when it's football, when it comes to weightlifting and everything. So his energy that he brings around to his teammates, I'm trying to bring that too. And then you got like Christian Jones, who he led by example. He didn't say much, but he definitely led by example. So that too, and Joyner, another guy who led by example, where he didn't talk so much on the field, but you, his past did a lot of talking. So like I said, I'm just trying to take every aspect out of the seniors that just left and add that to my game. Yeah, obviously, with those guys, it's hard to get on the field defensively, <laughs> yeah. but you were able to make a huge impact on special teams. How important was that for you last year? Yeah, it was definitely hard to get on the field last year, but uh, special teams, I, I took it serious, like kickoff, I took I took all that serious. I mean, that was the only time I was going to pretty, pretty much get my tackles. So um, I took special teams serious, and it's a, we got some young cats coming in who's going to take special teams just as serious as I took it, so it won't be a drop-off. And how does your role change this year on the team from a you know guy who you primarily was with special teams, but now a guy who's kind of a leader on on the defense and getting out there and getting those reps? Uh, it, it changed your like dramatically, like overnight, pretty much. I mean, all the seniors leaving, Telvin leaving, and Christian leaving that linebacker, and that just opened up the doors for me to just step in and pretty much take the take over the defense. And uh, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to make sure I know everything, get everybody in the right spot, so we as a defense can just compete and be number one again. Well, with you now stepping up into a bigger role, do you feel more pressure? Uh, I'm, I wouldn't say so much pressure, but because no matter what, everybody must know the defense, but. Definitely, uh, I know that most of the time, if something bad happens, it's going to fall back on me. But I don't see it as pressure. I just, something I got to step up to. That's it. Just challenge, challenge, real challenge. So how much do you think the other guys around you, some of the younger guys, are kind of relying on, on your leadership, on, on what you do out in the field? Um, we rely on each other, I would say, a lot more than just one person. Because we're we're still learning the defense. We're trying to make sure... Um, everybody's on the same page, and uh, we're getting there. We're getting there. As, as spring is coming to an end, we're, I say we're getting there. But uh, we're going to push it no matter what. We're going to push through. What do you think of uh, Coach Kelly not being the defensive coordinator? Oh, uh, it's great. It's great. I mean, same system, same. We run the same things. So, I mean, it's. And the, the one new coach you have, Coach Miller, out there with you guys, how, how would you describe him? Coach Miller's a great guy. I mean, if you've heard, he's coached a lot of the greats. He coached Ray Lewis. I mean, he's been everywhere. So he knows exactly what he's doing. He knows, I mean, it's just for us to accept him as our teacher and play through whatever he teaches us. So that's, that's pretty much it. So he's a great coach. So which of those linebacker positions that they have do you working at the most so far in this ring? Uh, primarily in the middle, but I'm about to play some, uh, some, some weak side linebacker also. Just interchangeable, pretty much. Stay happy with the mic. Oh, uh, yeah, Mike.